Hi everyone, welcome back on Eric's Life with Autism, and um, today we're going to talk about um, social distancing. That's basically what I want to talk about. It's a new topic. Um, just wanted to tell you my experience with it. It's it's kind of weird doing so, but I think eventually. It, everything will work out. It's just going to take time. Um, I'll just basically say this in my best way that I know how. I don't like it when people like try and, you know, can't even get the words out. Um, I'm just going to tell you in the best way that I know how. Um, we're going to say, number one, these are like, two questions before I start it. Number one, social distancing. That's the name of this topic. And that's what this blog is and what my experience is with it. Um, I'm still practicing, you guys. For the most part, I know how to do it. It's just getting to be a little bit more difficult. It's more... More so, it's basically more challenging than what I thought. And, um, you know, we just, you know, you have to tell, like, your friends or whatever. Um, you, you know, um, you know, that you have to sit or be so many distance away from a person because you can't go up, like close up to somebody. Um, there are things that you can and cannot do anymore. Um, I've actually watched a video on it and it was quite interesting. Um, it's going to be the newest adventure that I've ever, ex that I will ever experience. And I'm looking forward to taking that challenge and going out into the real world and figuring out what it's all about. I mean, I'm practicing the social distancing here where I live. I'm not going to tell you where I live because it's private, so I won't tell you where I live. But um, we'll just say every day I practice social distancing. It's, it's fun. I did a lot of that, um, today. It was a very, very nice day. Wait, wait, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, wait a minute. I'm sorry. Not today. I meant yesterday. I'm so sorry. I meant not today because it's one o'clock in the morning. I meant yesterday I practiced. I am so sorry. Um there was a lot of a lot of exciting things going on yesterday, so I was thinking about something totally different. But I was outside on and off yesterday and trying to learn how to do it more and kind of coach myself on the social distancing to see how well I do it on my own. I mean, sometimes we might make a mistake, but it's, it's really, it is a challenge. It's, it's so challenging. It is a challenge every day just trying to figure out, okay, um, is it okay to go, um, you know, I don't know, but it will be okay. I'm, I'm learning. I'm learning every single day, every single day. I'm, I know how, how many, how far you're supposed to be in distance wise. It's just, everybody is practicing it still. Um, it's not where you're going to be. 200% accurate and you know, oh, you know, where you know 
what you're doing um, most of the time. But really, right now, it's very confusing for some of us. And for everybody, it is a challenge. I mean, it's going to take time. I don't know for how long for the social distancing. Um, but practice makes perfect. It's just the the practice part of knowing how far, how, you know, how far or what. I don't know. This is a very difficult um, blog for me. Um, especially when I say I want to talk about social distancing. Um, I'm just doing it the best way that I know how um, to explain it. Um, but it is a challenge for me because I'm not used to doing anything like that. And this is totally new for all of us. Everybody. I mean everybody. Not just myself, but everybody. Um, I'm going to say maybe in about a month or so, it might get better for me. Um, I guess I'm going to have to practice it every day. I'll have a lot of time to do that. I'm going to make time today and do that. Go out and practice my social distancing. And it is very fun. I can make it fun. Um, I mean, I can still socialize with my friends and stuff, but um, I'll figure it out, and I'll let you guys know. Um, I will not be doing vlogs outside of my home. Just for privacy reasons, I... I normally do my blogs normally, but I'm doing it a little bit more different than what I did it did before. But I'll still do blogs, though. Um, I'll give you guys updates on how the how my social distancing is going. I mean, practice makes perfect, but we all know that we're not perfect. I know I'm not perfect, you know. Um. So, um, like I said, it's going to take time. I'm going to say probably, I don't know. Big question about the social distancing. Big question. How long is that going to go on? Is it going to be permanent or what? Only time will tell how long the social distancing is. That's, that's the, um, the big the big thing that I really want to know is, is that something permanent that, um, that we have to take the next challenge? Well, I'll find out on my adventure, which is a new adventure right now, as a matter of fact, and it's quite... It's exciting. I just don't like it. It's another change. I don't like it. But I'm going to do okay with it. All I got to do is pay attention and um, ask the person how they do it or whatever. It can be a lot of fun. But um, probably like in about a month or so I should have it down pat I'll have to give it time I don't want to um, automatically say oh I've already learned how to do it and I I'm you know oh I know how to do social distancing oh yeah I know how to do it no I don't want to automatically tell somebody that and get all excited and be like oh I know how to do this that's like almost telling someone that you're better than that and you know how to do it and you're better than that and you can do other things. I just don't want to hurt people's feelings or, or anything like that. So, But I'll see you guys next time and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you later. Bye.